this is really steep, probably close to 35 degrees, maybe even a little steeper. Siberia Ridge. Nice, dude. Jump it. <laughs> Good job, dude. It's pretty steep, huh? Us. Go for it. KT. 22. Getting pretty dry, look how dry the fingers are. These cliffs right here, straight ahead. Where does that go? Off to the right. That goes to the top of the mountain. Well, go, or top of the mountain, then over to Alpine. So it connects uh, Palisades here and Alpine. Alpine yeah, Alpine's on the other side, down below. Dude, why is that open for longer if there's, no, if there's more snow up here? Well, the faces over there are pretty much all north facing, so it doesn't get the sun that warms it up. So the snow there actually lasts longer, even though it's slightly lower elevation. Water flowing. So let's peek off to the left here, Matthew, the rock peak. So there's a little couloir there in the middle, but that left rock face, it's like 55 degrees. People occasionally ski that when it has a lot of snow, fresh snow on it. Yeah, people will ski down that. It's insane. And some guys have been like seriously injured falling on it, you know, because they hit a rock or something under the snow and lose it. Yeah, it's called Eagle's Nest. Probably the gnar well, maybe not the gnarliest, but probably one of the gnarliest lines here. Probably only get skied a couple dozen times each year. There's a the lake. Not covered in fog this time. No, can I see the lake today? See the flags up there, Matthew? So there's a metal eagle sculpture up the top.
Alright, top of KT-22. Got the eagle's nest up there. We got alpine to the north. Alright, we're gonna go do women's downhill. Ready? Black diamond, but <laughs> it's squaw, so it's still gonna be steep and gnarly. You know, just a regular black diamond. All right, ready, Matthew? Yeah. Just pick your line. Giant mogul. So Steve here, I literally touched the ground with my right hand. <laughs> 